This is the Peak Design Slide Light camera strap. I have it for about one month. Let me share with you the experience. First of all, let's start with the build quality of this camera strap and the build quality on this camera strap is really amazing. The strap itself is built out of this seat belt like material. Feels really durable and strong. It's pretty thick as well. Then here on this part of the camera strap, you have a little bit of rubber material just to add a little bit of grip when you're spinning or turning the strap around your body. This is the tensioning mechanism and this is built out of plastic and aluminum and it feels as well really high quality. Even the button, the screw in here is built out of aluminum. And the anchors, of course, are built as well out of aluminum mixed with high quality plastic. With the camera strap, you also get this nice compact carrying case and you also get this attachment for your camera. And these anchors, whatever you call them, you get four of them, you get one, two, uh, three, four of these anchor coins. This you do not get with the camera strap. This is the Falcom F38 camera strap mount. I've made a video about this thing. If you want to watch it, I'm going to leave a link up here somewhere. Now I want to measure the weight of the camera strap and it's exactly 133 grams minus the case weight. And also if I'm going to add this camera mount system, it's going to be 142 grams in total, really lightweight. Now I want to talk about adjustability and this is one of the main reasons why I bought this camera strap. I have the Peak Design Everyday Sling bag which has the same mechanism of adjustability and it's really simple to adjust the height of your camera with this camera strap. You just slide this thing is this adjustment mechanisms downwards to bring your camera lower and then you can swing pull them upwards to bring the camera higher. It works pretty smooth, not as smooth I must say as on my sling bag, but it's pretty easy to use and it's pretty quick at the same time. And then the next reason why I bought this camera strap is because of this anchor mechanism, because now I can remove the camera from the camera strap really quickly, just press one button here, remove this thing and then I remove it from this place and basically now my camera is without the camera strap and if I want to attach it back, I just slide it in and then slide it in again and I have the camera on the camera strap. Really convenient and really quick. Next thing is comfort and to be honest, I've been using this camera strap for the last month and it's really comfortable. I have no issues whatsoever when it comes to comfort. I do have issues with my Big design sling bag when it comes to comfort, but this camera strap is really comfortable. I'm using the camera strap with my Fujifilm X-T4 and the Fujinon 16-55, which weighs about 1.3 kilograms. And I have no issues whatsoever when it comes to comfort with this camera strap and my camera. I'm actually using this camera strap when I'm doing uh, bike rides because I want to take pictures of the places that I'm going with my bicycle. And usually I have the camera on me for about three, four hours, sometimes even five hours, and I have no issues whatsoever when it comes to comfort. It's really, really comfortable, but I guess if you have a heavier camera, I think maybe the slide, original slide uh, camera strap would be much more suitable for you because this camera strap is designed for lightweight mirrorless cameras, but if you have something heavier, the slide version would be more suitable for your needs. Okay, so the build quality is great. It's really comfortable, easy to adjust, easy to remove from the camera, but it is not perfect. Let me share with you now what I don't like about the Peak Design uh, Slide Light camera strap. All right, so the first problem is the annoying loops that this camera strap can create when you put your camera pretty high. So for example, if I'm gonna put the camera higher, okay, and now I'm gonna take a picture. As you can see, I have these loops now on the sides which are really annoying. I can definitely feel them in my face and also on my right hand. And it's really uncomfortable, especially if you're shooting in portrait mode, just like so. Becomes really annoying. This loop gets right in, into my face and it's really uncomfortable. What you can do to combat this issue is to mount one point of the strap on the side 
And then the second one to mount it at the bottom, just like so. So basically now you have one on the side of the camera and one at the bottom of the camera. And now basically the right loop is not here and it's really comfortable in landscape mode and also in portrait mode. What I usually do, I just don't attach the camera strap to the sides of the camera. I attach both of the points to the bottom of the camera and then the camera is completely free basically. Nothing is annoying me in this position. You can hold the camera here comfortably and also in this position. Feels really comfortable. The next minor issue that I have with this camera strap is that it's a little bit hard to remove the camera strap from the camera, at least with this model. So if I'm gonna press this button in here, this coin thing, and as you can see, it gets stuck between the strap and the anchor mechanism. So now I have to kind of fiddle with it to remove it, and now it's off. It's not really smooth in my opinion, it's working sometimes, but not all the time. So it's a little bit annoying to remove the camera stuff from the camera, but it works pretty well. Not perfect, but pretty well. What I do to combat this issue because it gets on my nerves sometimes, I attach the camera strap to the bottom with the Falcom F38 mechanism that I showed you before in the beginning of the video. And now I can remove the camera with one push of a button, just like so, and that's it, as you can see. Press one button, remove the camera. Press one button, remove the camera. Much quicker than using the anchor mechanism on the Peak Design. Anywho guys, I think this is pretty much it for today. Overall, I really like the Peak Design slide light camera strap. It's really comfortable, the build quality is great. Easy to adjust, pretty easy to remove, but you do get these annoying loops on the sides when you attach the camera strap to the sides of the camera. Let me know down below which camera stop do you use and if you use the camera stop that comes uh, with the camera, with the camera that you buy by default. Hope you enjoyed this video and found it informative and I guess I will see you in the next one. Peace out.